See, show me the money. Oh, dude, are you kidding me? Hey, what the frick is going on, guys? So we finally did it today. We finally found another abandoned vending machine. And you know what that means, guys. We're going to be breaking it open and seeing if we can find money. I know you guys have been waiting for these kind of videos. It's been about a year since my last abandoned vending machine video, but it's not too often we come across these. But so far, we found three abandoned vending machines, and in every single one of those, we found money. So let's keep that streak going today. This is probably the coolest abandoned vending machine we've come across yet. It's a vintage Coke vending machine, maybe from the 80s, but that's just a total guess. I know it's old, though, because it would only cost 50 cents to buy a drink. Now that's crazy. If only we can go back to those times. And I've got a pretty good feeling there's still going to be money inside this thing because when I checked the change return, look what I found. There's actually money inside there. Let's grab that really quick. A few quarters. There's still more though. Look at that. Almost a dollar in change left in the return. So who knows what's going to be inside the vending machine. Only one way to find out though. We found this vending machine inside of an abandoned nursing home and they left a ton of other stuff too. So hopefully they forgot to empty the money out of the machine. And this was abandoned not too long ago. So this machine could have been running fairly recently. We're going to try our best not to destroy it when breaking into it because I'm sure it's got some value. One more thing before we break into this abandoned vending machine and see if we can find some money. I know I say this all the time, but I know we got some new viewers here. We're not just going into random abandoned places and stealing stuff, guys. My dad has a demolition contract for this building and has rightful ownership of all the contents left inside, including this vending machine. Now, I could just be making this up, but if I wasn't doing this legally, why would I post it on YouTube? All right, guys, meet Demolition Dad. What's up, guys? I'm Demolition Dad, and I like to break shit. So, as always, Demolition Dad is going to be breaking into this vending machine for us. How are we going to do it this time? I'm going to use this slide hammer right here. I'm going to try and take one of these screws, screw it into the lock right here. We'll have the slide hammer hooked to the screw and hopefully yank the lock out and open her up. This is for educational purposes only, guys. Don't be going and breaking into vending machines. We have legal permission to do this. Tap it in just to get it started. Okay, this hole is pretty small, not even this small screw. Get started in there. It's a pretty old box, right? Yeah. Can't even get one thread started. See if I can make it a little bigger with this hammer. Have we done a lock like this before? Yeah, but the hole was a little bit bigger. I used it bigger screws. Let's do it. Bam, there's the lock right there. And that's how you take a lock out with a slide hammer or dent puller as some people call it. And that was pretty easy. We've broken into way harder ones. Is the door open? Oh, this didn't pop out yet. So close guys, right here. So we're having some difficulties right now. There's still a small piece of that lock stuck in there, that round piece with the holes in it. We're trying to rip that out of there and then we'll be in. We got a little bit bigger screwdriver and a two pound sledgehammer. We're just gonna keep working with it. See if we can twist it out of here somehow. It's like wedged in there. It's coming out. apart right there. Oh, here we go, guys. It's right there. Things about to pop open. Oh, Man, there we go. Is. We're in. Dane, he's good, guys. Let's open it up. 
See, show me the money. Oh, dude, are you kidding me? That is literally freaking loaded to the top, guys. Holy cow. Wedged Another in there. jackpot. Man, look at all that money. Oh my so God, that's so heavy, dropped, yeah. Dude. <laughs> wow. That's way more than I expected. Did they, did they ever empty this thing out? Holy cow. It's full. And is there money in this thing? Yep, there's money in the changer too. Look at this, guys. I'm gonna count this right away. It's probably gonna be at least 100 bucks and change right there, if wow. not more. We're, we're so lucky. I'm so grateful to have these jobs. Yeah, it's an easy payday right there. I can't believe they would leave that behind. Look at this right here. We got about seven dollars and quarters still in there. Does it say? Yeah, right here. Wow. Three dollars and nickels and probably seven dollars and dimes. Wow. And this whole bucket of change. So if there's that much there, what do you think, sir? Uh, maybe two hundred. I don't know. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Two. I'll, I'll say two. Sadly, no dollar bills because this thing is so old. But that is a big chunk of change it. right there. I'll take there. it. That's yeah, no we'll cash. take that. Oh. oh, it's spilling it everywhere. Let's do it on the table. What's in this thing right here? Oh my God, there's a freaking mouse in there. I thought that was gonna be like another change bucket. Don't, don't get bit, dude. Oh, he's so cute, guys. Look at that. That's the first time we found a mouse in a vending machine. Get it in the light here. You can see him better. Well, to relocate him. Can you see him? Yeah. Aw, isn't he so cute, guys? I want to take him home. He's got his little nest made in here. Yeah, we'll definitely have to relocate him. I wonder if there's more. What's he doing in there? I mean, it's home out of this vending machine, so this must have been abandoned for at least a year. That's insane. We've never found a mouse inside of a vending machine. There wasn't room in here for him. Yeah. Voted to the top with change, guys. Look, it's mostly quarters, too. That is awesome. What should we name him? Oh, my God, there's two. Look at that. It's oh, probably got a little buddy in there. I think that's a mom and a baby, maybe? We'll have to find a safe place for these guys because if they stay in here, they're going to get crushed. Look at he's cleaning his face, see him? Yeah. It's got to be camera ready. It's a big debut right now. Think of a name for this guy or both of these guys. Aw. Hey, buddy, you're famous. So the mice are cool and all, but let's get to the big find the cash. Take a guess at how much money's in here, guys. Leave your comment down below. Let's see who can get closest to it. I'm guessing 200. You're guessing? 250. 250. Who knows? Might be even more. This could easily be 300. That's a lot of quarters right there. They must have never emptied this thing out. The old people must have loved their soda. That's insane. That might be the most money we've ever pulled out of a vending machine. The most change, at least. Last chance to take your guess in the comments on how much money we found. We're counting it up right now. He's filling it. It's rolling. Wow. Dang, that's a lot. Look at all those shiny quarters. Wow, this is too much to count. I need a change. This couldn't on. have been too old. None of these quarters look extremely old. Yeah, the machine's old, but they probably you know as the years go. Yeah. Went. Two hours later. Wow, we really need to invest in a change counter, guys. That took super freaking long to count, but hey, I'm not complaining. That's still free money right there. So in total, I counted $110 in quarters. My dad counted 105 so that's 215 in quarters, plus all the nickels and dimes, which we didn't bother to count. We're just going to guess on that. I'm going to say 20 which is probably on the low end, so... You were pretty damn close. We got 235 right there, so almost 250. We still got more in the chain. Oh yeah, I forgot about that, guys. Still some inside remember? the machine. Let's take a look. Let's see, the quarters is about seven dollars, so and then another three dollars in nickels, ten more bucks right there, and then another seven dollars in dimes. So that's over 250. What is that? Barely over 250, yeah, right? Yeah, that puts like, me right there, though. 255? Nice. nice. You were right on the money. Yes. Anybody get closer than he did, guys? So, ballpark, $250 left inside this vending machine. Took a little bit of extra effort to get in there, but that was well worth it. Not a bad payday. You got anything in mind you want to buy with this money? No. Okay, well, I'm taking it then. <laughs> That was a joke. Demolition Dad is actually keeping all the money from this because he did all the work, and this is his company after all. 
I'm just happy I got the video. If it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be able to film cool stuff like this for you guys. So everyone say thank you to Demolition Dad down in the comments. Well, we're going to wrap it up here, guys. I got to go find a new home for our little buddies. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like and subscribe and comment for more abandoned vending machine videos. Next time we find one, we're definitely going to film it if you guys want to see it. So that's about it. We'll see you in the next one. Squad out.